Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to No Mud's Land. Now, this level here, there's no Madakas to save. It's a big, it's a big combat stage. There's, um, in the beginning, there's like several different sections that you have to go through. Then at the very end, there's like this big, large area with like the gates and stuff that they have. So hopefully I can get through here without it being too awkward. And, um, all right, let's do it. Okay, Talk to our boy first. All the money. Donate all the money to Lulu. Every single bit of it. Too bad I can't turn spoofs into money. You can take my $8. <laughs> all right. Yeah, this level has several different sections to it uh, that we're going to have to try to figure out. I remember this level taking quite a bit longer than some of the other levels due to how much combat there are. There's several different strategies that you can do. Etc. Etc. Not it's not too bad, but you do need to be careful. Uh one wrong move and you're freaking toast. I'm gonna get Munch to go down here, which is where he needs to be, just in case I freaking die. Because uh this section up here, we can take him out with the mines or we can take him out with possession. You can't always use possession though, because there's one or two rooms that they block the possession and they really make you use the bombs. So try to figure this out i've actually been watching videos on this game lately or, well this game here and like other games uh, about the odd world lore and that kind of thing apparently it's uh like abe's skin is blue because he either sun tans was one of the theory uh, another theory was um his spiritual powers which i'm gonna go with spiritual powers more than him sun tanning is why he's blue and that, that that's kind of um Hey, it's all good. I think he's blue because in game development, they didn't want you to look exactly like your buddies and get confused on who the hell you're playing as when you have a bunch of friends near you. Especially in, you know, like the first couple of games where you literally look exactly like them. But, uh, you had a different skin color. Just interesting. But yeah. Just watching random videos about the lore of certain characters and stuff like that. You know, and... I was watching some Mullock videos and uh, some videos about the Vikers. Just stuff like that. It's pretty interesting. I almost fucking killed myself. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. There's a guy down there and I'm trying to aim this. Not stupid. Okay. That, okay hold on. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this and I can actually let uh, Munch through. Yeah, I can let Munch through with this guy. Just stand on the button, switch over to Munch, get on the wheelchair, which he needs to be on anyway, and bada bing. Okay. Do keep Munch away from the doors, though, because if I open the door up and there's a slig in there, he's probably going to get freaking killed because he can't jump up there. He can go back, though. He can run away, I think. Something like that. Okay, let me see here. Camera, or, or not camera, but Abe, get off the... Get off the bomb. I know you're happy to see it, but... <laughs> okay, so I don't know if you guys can see that, but there is a, a thing over here that will stop me from using the possession. Stand on the other side of this little doorway here in order to use it. Otherwise, it'll probably zap me and it'll be a bad day. Don't do that either. We don't need extra spoofs at the moment. Although... I believe there's a part of the level where we need 99 spoofs in order to activate one of the whales. Something like that. It, it's all coming back to me slowly. <laughs> okay. I uh, got some spoofs up in here. I might let Munch through after I take out the next area. I'll, I'll leave that. I'll let that close back down for now. Might go get the spoofs though. Always need the spoofs, especially if we need 99 of them. Okay, let me see if I can get back out of here. Watch this bad platforming skills. My non-existent platforming skills. Oh, God, I almost ran right off right there. Okay, it wouldn't have been a bad thing, but... uh, Trying to keep this clean, guys. Trying to keep it clean. Okay, we have a... 
We have a good opportunity to use bombs right here. I'm going to quick save. Yeah, do a little quick save right there. Okay, let me see here. Turn my walk on. That way I don't jump too far. Okay. I am standing on the damn bomb. That that was awesome. Okay. I should be able to take these guys here out in one row. Very good. Very good indeed. I th think that was everybody. I don't hear anybody else sleeping or any shenanigans going on. I can't really possess from down here. <clears throat> okay, I don't see anybody. Gather a few dangerous spoofs. Make my way back up. I'll let Munch through here in a moment. I'm trying to be careful and not die I'll let him through in a moment oh whoa 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 okay okay risky maneuvers I might actually get the hell out of here my damn self that was almost dangerous <laughs> yeah yeah don't do that uh you'll end up fucking killing yourself it ain't worth it okay much go on ahead and get through there that 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 is okay with me you stay right there sir I'm going to climb back up in a room that's hopefully safer and uh, not die. That's if I land on a mine. I mean, I won't die like right away, but I'd rather not take early damage like that because that would that would suck. I remember back on my first playthrough of this, though, I'm trying to go all the way through the game and such, you know, 100%. This one, this is definitely a level that uh, is memorable. And I like that. that. That's good. I, that that was. I need. I need the spoos, but but not right now, Abe. I'm I'm trying to explain things, and uh, and get through here. Do I have a gun. Yes, I do. Okay. Did he? Did he die? I didn't hear any. I didn't hear him actually die. Uh. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, you can hear them running around, but if you walk slowly, you can actually hear their footsteps more. Especially that first step. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was nerding on audio for just a moment. Um, <laughs> I do that sometimes. I'll catch myself like... Like, oh, check this out. Oh, check that out. And, and, and no one else cares. I'm sorry. No, nobody else cares. I get intrigued by video games and audio and video design. Or game design, okay? Put it that way. I'll make it really general. I get nerded out about game design a little bit. and um, That's just me, man. That's just me. Maybe you guys do too. Maybe I'm not the only odd one. Oh, yeah. Big bro time. Here we go. Watch this shit. <laughs> Loser. You wussy. Fegging brutal. Okay. Uh, I need to go over there and there's... Two or three of them? This is going to be fun. Time to murder everything. Here we go. A little tip I'm going to give you about big bro gameplay. Don't let the small slugs get too close, especially the ones that have the gun. They can't melee attack, and if they get underneath you, you can't hit them, and you move so slow that you can't get away from them. So once they're up on you, you're done. Just like that. Okay, let's let Munch through, and we should be good. Munch, where are you at? Ah, you are right there. I gotta do some shit. Hold on. Oh, I thought I was gonna land on the button. We have a heal up over there, and I believe we have an invisible soda machine behind us. We will need both of those. We'll definitely need the invisible one for the next area, for damn sure. Okay, Munch, you stay right there. Oh, God, I ran the wrong damn way. That was not what I meant to do. 
<laughs> I meant to run this way. The thing is about this game, when you switch back and forth sometimes, I feel like the camera gets flipped around a bit and I was disoriented and ran straight into it. Good thing is, now that I'm hurt, I can demonstrate the health up machine all according to my masterful plan of demonstrations. <laughs> I fucked up. I definitely fucked up. Okay. Munch, you need to go over there. We're going to have to lose the whole chair. And, uh... Luckily, there's no achievement for not bashing your head in on mines on this level here. So, uh... All good. All good. I should probably check my achievements since I don't have all the achievements. And maybe we can get a few more during this playthrough. Um... Okay, we need 99 here. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to process, like, the next part of the level and such. Because we're getting ready to get into some shit. Uh, much... Uh, there's a... There's a lever... Okay, this is a part of the video where I might not remember everything 100% to the T. Yeah, there's an area up here with some spoos for much. There's a lever there. Okay, okay, I'm gonna get in the wheelchair... But we have more Abe gameplay that we're going to have to do because uh, this next little section up here is going to require possession. It's going to require me to run through and unlock several different levers. For now, though, I'm going to get a slig and hopefully have him not shoot at me or murder me. I think this guy here has a baton, though. Yeah, he has a baton. I can step on that button with my possession. Cool, okay. Uh, yes, I have a baton. I need to probably blow myself up and open this door. <laughs> Did you guys hear that? Oh my god, I haven't heard that dialogue in so long. Dude, I love this game so damn much. <laughs> that was fucking funny funny as shit <laughs> sorry for the profanity but man that that is that is awesome <laughs> we kick booty i killed myself man you know what i mean like <laughs> all right we need to run through here very 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 carefully don't smack a hoe on a drive-by or you'll become not invisible anymore uh there's a lever over here okay I need to take out the rest of the slicks in this area first, though. Because if I don't, um, shenanigans will happen. And I'll, and Munch will be having his door opened up and he'll get attacked. And that's just, that, that's bad. We don't want that. Okay. What I'm going to do. Sorry, my nose is itching me to death here. I'm going to possess an, the big brother. Yeah, the big bro. Be careful, though, because I mentioned before, if you let the normal slicks too close to the big brother, uh, he's pretty much dead. Don't possess that guy on accident. Also, I apologize if there's a jump cut if I sneeze, because um, I'm feeling it. I'm I'm, I'm feeling it. It's, it's right there. He got me. It's okay. Take that guy out. Okay, I got him. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, whoa. I'm sequence breaking. <laughs> okay, we have two spoofs. Okay, I'm going to get some spoofs. Where can I regrow some spoofs? Get a little bit back here. Because we're going to need it. I'm going to try to take him out in that general area over there. That way I can open up the gate for Munch and let him go through. Then there's like the ending area that you get to, et cetera, et cetera. You'll see, you'll see, you'll see. We're almost there. This so far, fingers crossed, is going fairly nice. I'll possess this guy. Okay, what's going on here? Who, who am I going to have to fuck up here? Okay, there's the gate right there. It's you. You're already hurt. I'm not. 
Get your ass beat. I'm going to put a beat down on your ass. <laughs> this is the gameplay everybody wanted right there. Okay. That guy got murked. Um, I can't really do anything else with him. So, um, did I attack that? No. Okay. I was going to blow him up with hitting it with a baton, but it's okay. It's okay. Let me see here. Uh, invisible. Hold on. Actually, a little munch gameplay. Here we go. Hold on. There's shit happening. There's sligs over there, aren't they? Oh, God. We have we have thick boy artillery. Okay. Don't bait me. Oh, God. You don't see me. You don't see me. Oh, I'm going to get hit. Oh, I knew it. Um, pretend that didn't happen. Let's go save our boy. Where the frig is the egg? Hmm. Okay, I went back and got Munch. Um, you got to do the whole maze and button thing again. There was no reason to show that because I've already shown how to get through there once. We're back, though. We're good to go. I'm going this way. I wonder what the hell this even takes us to. I, I can't remember. Better be good. Oh, okay. Don't do that. That That's bad. That's how you get up there. It's okay. We're safe. We're not. Oh, you're a moron. That was straight up bait. <laughs> Suck it. A free death. You know what? I'm going to leave you right here. That was worth it. Every freaking waking moment of it. Okay. Uh, that door was open as well. Let me see here. Let me, uh, how much spooks we got? We got eight. Open the door back up. I think. Hold up. We're going to do some shit. We're going to do some shit. I, I can't remember what, like, what all gates were open. But I might be fine if I run in there. All invisible and hide in the corner somewhere safe. Maybe look we'll, like where the big brother was at. Close that door back. That way nobody tries to go out there and beat the shit out of Munch. Y'all don't see me. Okay, that gate's open. So that's where they're at. Okay. I'm going to stand way the hell back here where they can't see me whatsoever. And let's do some uh, infiltration. Pretty much Metal Gear Solid style. Sneak up in here and... And they'll, they'll never see it coming. We're doing some Psycho Mantis shit. There's a traitor amongst... Amongst the slags. Oh, there was a big brother right there. Let's get that guy. Let's get that guy instead and go pretty much kill everything. We'll try that instead. This level's actually not too bad, though. I, I don't know why, but I remember it being a lot worse to uh, play and finish than it has been during my video. Who knows? Okay. Those guys right there are both armored and have guns. I'm going to stand back and take them out. Okay, that one's got a baton. Take him out. Those are actually more dangerous than the ones with the guns. I'm going to have to do some post-audio editing, by the way. That's feckin' loud. One thing I will say, I apologize if the audio, if you can hear it like compressing, I do have a limiter on my game audio just for times like this, because I know these games can get loud. <laughs> get, get wrecked. Okay. Oh, I'm getting my ass beat. Oh, I'm so sorry. I apologize. I apologize. Don't do it. Oh, you fucking, you fucking nerd. I swear. 
<laughs> he was beating my ass. That's karma for flipping him off. <laughs> How much did I get hurt? Oh, he was a baby back bitch. Okay, I have one spoose. Man, remember what I was talking about? Like, you know, oh, the level's going pretty good. You know, I'm, I'm safe. I'm, I'm good. I'm cool. No. You screwed it. If you're wondering why I'm getting pre spoofs there, even though there's spoofs up ahead, I'm probably going to run out. Probably going to run out. Man, my run was going good, too, man. I was killing everybody. Nobody suspected a thing. And then they did. Then they started, like, punching me uncontrollably. Okay. Close that back. Run up in here. Yo, nobody sees me. Uh, I'm going to take those guys right there out right away because they're clearly the ones that fucking saw me if there's no threat there's no problem okay die okay i think we might be good i should have used that guy I actually pressed the wrong button i was trying to shoot my gun just to be gun happy for a moment and i i killed him that was bad I'm going to use five because I have no idea how far away the next slig boy might be. Where you at? There's more off to that right side area there. So I am not too concerned with that. Okay, here we go. Here we go. You got a baton. You got a gun. Got a damn gun. Although that guy right there has armor, and I probably should have got him instead, but... Yeah, I'm fucking die right here. Die. Take their health down. Do a little shimmy. A little, little, little bootleg scooting. <laughs> you can't hit me if you can't see me. <laughs> Wait, they going around the wall here. Dude. The shimmy is real. I literally have one HP left, and they were both shooting me. They were both armored. They have more HP than I do. I'm going to die right here. Oh, he shot me right in the forehead. Okay. Uh, we should be fine. Should be all good. Although, I'm not going to be messing around too much. But five more out there. Let me see if I can go possess one of them on the ground again. Because I know there's some more armored ones, and I just... I don't know, man. I think the scooting shoot's putting in work. You have a baton. I'm going to go get my ass beat. Who's around here? Who goes there? I'm standing right there, huh? Okay. Can I go up in here? No. I think we might be good. I think that might have been everything. Oh, man. There's going to be some shit, huh? I'm going to be real quiet. Bop, dop, dot. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. There's a guy right there. Can I, like, turn the sneak on and be going like this? Hold on. <laughs> okay. Got you. Okay. You see nothing. Oh, okay. He didn't shoot that guy. He shot me. He didn't give a shit. You don't see a damn thing. Uh, camera? What the hell are you? I had to press down to go up. Yep. It happened. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. He let me think that I had some shit going on. Some yeah, gotta do the Lulu fun thingy. Not on this level here, but I was thinking that there was some Lulu fun happening. Okay, 
I'm gonna sneak my ass back and oh shit, fuck. <laughs> okay. Uh that is a that's a Oh yeah. What you gonna do about it? Huh? What you gonna do about it? What you gonna do about it? Give me your lunch money, bitch. Okay. We're going this way. I almost totally forgot. I was trying to go up the ramp there and was just going to go through the front gate. You know, like Snake tried to do or was going to do on the second level of Metal Gear Solid. Can't just knock on the front door and ask them to let me in. You got that damn right. They're going to fuck you up, homie. Okay. We made it. It's going to be all right. We made it through Splinters. Or uh, Nomad's Land into Splinters. We're going to the boiler room. Catch you guys there.